Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to download and install the free Komodo Internet Security Suite. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up a web browser. Doesn't matter which one, but I'm going to use Google Chrome for today's tutorial. And into Google, you want to go search up Komodo Internet Security and just search for it. And it should be a Komodo domain here. So go ahead and just select the Komodo Home Free Internet Security. It should be near the top. Select the Download Free button. Go ahead and select that. Select the Keep button if for some reason it's not allowed to install for some reason. Again, should be a Komodo domain up at the top. You can see it's also Connection Secure notification, so there's no reason that this is not Komodo. So we're going to go ahead and open up the installer. Close out of the web browser too if you want. If you receive a user account, control pop or a security pop up you could select yes looks like for some reason it closed out so let me go ahead and reopen that and I'm gonna run it select yes if you receive the user account control prompt So you should get a pop-up here saying Commodore Internet Security Premium. Go ahead and make sure your language is correct and then select Accept and Install. And this will take a couple minutes to download, so just be patient.
Okay, so now you got a few different options here. So I'm going to unselect the option and change my DNS provider to Komodo. I will keep Cloud Behavior Behavioral Analysis checkmarked. I will keep Anonymous Program Usage checkmarked as well. I'm going to uncheck the option to enhance my web browsing experience with Yahoo. And I'm also going to turn off Set Komodo Dragon as my default browser. If you were going through the custom settings during the installation, you could have unchecked some of these. You could have perhaps not installed Komodo Dragon. It's not a huge deal, honestly, but we're going to go ahead and select finish here. And there you go, guys. Pretty simple. You can see it's all on our computer at this point. So if you want to go run a scan, restart your computer, check for updates, you're more than welcome to. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.